Flashback. End of flashback. YOLO, everybody, and welcome to the Haynes Demon Show. We got ourselves the Easter special. And I have seen some brand new shoots coming up for the first time here, up here at the front. You could see one right there. It's not too big, but it is coming up. But this one right here is gonna be a lot thicker so that's gonna be nice it's a lot thicker than what i have for the rest of this so i can't wait to see what's coming up more i know there's gonna be more montage A few inches later. What's up, everybody, and welcome back on in to the end of the video. It's been about a month and a half. I can't think off the top of my head how long it's been. I would say about a month and a half since I started taking the pictures on a day to day. Actually, I think we we might be at two months. So I've been taking pictures on a day to day and day on and off, you know, for two months now. And I was hoping you guys would enjoy that little, you know, which call it. I was thinking you guys would enjoy that slideshow and uh, watching it kind of grow without me having to record every couple days or whatever and me ended up saying something and whatnot and hootenanny. But let's take a look at it real quick here through the eyes of the video. And as you can see here, the big, the biggest, tallest one and the furthest one away has it let itself grow, uh, spread out all of its nice leaves. And it's about, 
it's about a foot away from where the other two plants are, which I think most of the shoots are from the left plant and not the right one, but uh, the other one's still doing good. And you can see like the nice white color, if I can get it to focus, white color along these nodes and a real nice green, a bright green there. I really like it a lot. I think the one back here, the one back here is where you can really see the shine of the new colors come through and also you can tell how much more thick the plant has got. This one right here is pretty thick now compared to what it was bef to before. You know like one of these ones where my finger is you know a lot wider than it. So this is a huge improvement from last year and I cannot wait to see what it's going to be next year because it seems like it's already went double in thickness so I can hope that it's going to be double in thickness for now and so what I'm thinking is uh, there is a lot of it really close together so hopefully it'll shoot out and spread a little bit better this next year coming up because I think most of the runners were on the back side where I had already dug the ditch so this is a runner get that off of that uh, this is a runner that ran into the air, right? So it just started sprouting leaves and everything. And it, like, there's like these each could be their own bamboo. You, what I'm thinking of doing here is do some air propagating, as I believe what they call it. So what I'll do is I'll just stack a bunch of dirt around this whole entire thing, and then put it, you know, like a bag around it, and let it sit for like the next year, and build some roots along this line and then I can snip it as far back as possible and I'll be able to grow a third plant. I guess technically it'd be a third plant since it's not directly connected to the mother plant. But I could do that with a couple of the other ones but I'm not really worried about the other runners. This, there's, I just had done some weed whacking so you kind of have some leftover stuff there but uh, this one just shows so much potential in my opinion. And I think you can tell a difference between a runner and whenever it's popping up out of the ground as a shoot itself is because you can see how far away the nodes are here from the bottom. It's it's huge, right? It's like my whole finger almost. Uh, but then here, the nodes are extremely close together and uh, they also are kind of like rigid, like they want to grow roots, basically. So I am enjoying this very much uh, and I cannot wait to see what it'll be next year but I hope you guys enjoyed checking it out I got a lot of work to do over here still if you guys seen some other stuff it's really hard to tell right now but if you remember from last year the the jungle was basically here and I've cut all this jungle and I've been working on the lowering the dirt and all that stuff and clearing everything out and the lilies are coming back up as we speak just like last year and the uh, um, cattails are coming up too, and I went ahead and I've already, um, I've already weed whacked everything, but you can kind of see where it rained. There's not a perfect ditch line since I haven't really worked on the ditch line from after here. It needs to be connected down there. Uh, and I got some pumpkins growing right over there, uh, which I'll be showing in a different video as well. We also got a couple new apple trees and well one of the apple trees isn't going to live but two apple trees and two and one peach and one pear which i'll show them in another video as well uh eventually when they're ready but that'll be it thank you guys very much for checking out the haze demon grow show i hope you guys have a wonderful day don't forget to bring a towel we will see you all on the flippity floppities peace out